Hi beautiful souls, thank you so much for joining us for this sacral chakra clearing. So the sacral chakra is located a few inches below our belly button. The color is orange and it represents our feelings, sexuality, desire, sensuality, procreation, pleasure, enthusiasm, relationships, union with nature, openness to others, and personal creativity. So let's get started. You can come to a comfortable seated position or lie down. Close your eyes, clear your mind, and come into this present moment. Inhale, belly expands. Exhale, belly toward the spine. Breathe in and out of your nose, taking deep cleansing breath. Being aware of any tension in your body, sending light with your breath to those areas to dissolve it away, lovingly releasing as you start to feel relaxed. Letting all that tension release through your breath. So we're gonna surround ourselves with a violet flame to transmute all negative energy. So bring your energy about two inches below the belly button to the sacral chakra. The color is orange. Visualize an orange spinning light, cleansing, balancing, clearing this energy center and releasing anything that does not belong there, blockages, stored emotions. You can visualize them coming out as black smoke or cloud and dissolving into that violet flame being transmuted. We're gonna call in all of our guides, star families, archangels to assist us in these activations and this healing and ask to be shown whatever is blocking you from receiving in this area. You can ask to be shown in visions, insight, thoughts. So removing any blockages or becoming aware of any negative thought patterns you may have that are holding you back from moving forward. Allow yourself to be open to receive these light code activations. Dare si tarato, buti kase, du sutba, baha kalima i o a, kaya hare se ma aya moha ke, ni kahate, si kahate, boha ke mehe, o kehe ya, boha nehe si toha ke, ka man de here si ta a. Koha we bali ke a tehera sita a naha mehebe to hasika de hare se te wa aki kamina handera se te ari tu ari tu ari tu ari tu se beke naha ke boto ori a mbeher kisi kandere se te Baka li randera se to aya bote he kye wa e un ha ya akbandera si daka kohe amma hi si ti ta te bate 
aya bora sete kira to are mahare kerenze ere seta aya tu ame aya tu ame aya tu ame aya tu ame kande hera sete aya ho we bebe aya ho we bebe vale kerete vale kerete ore se kara dore are miro te era tali maka mane se dera ti ore a Kandera sete ero tahala kare sete bala sete romatu usuto nikahare sete irote kindare sete ra dore are mi era di kara moko yabete dahare ndere se ke ande hera sita are du ayamate era daya haya so Marese Kombei Atu Kombei Atu Kombei Kombei Atu Atu Kale mela kila ale mela ki, de hera se de rati, kan de hera sata uhare kala, maharen de kiro terese kara tu, biaru erete kira ure an behekera, suzeri nali. Dera la lo hare mera ke sera tu are kule ra si tara ma te era tu hare ki hara ma hare ma hare ma hare ma hare ma dera sa dera tu aya ma ke ko heran dera si tara oya ma re se ke mo heran de era la ku hi tali me sa ke ya ma re se te. Ho hia mante are wela mare ki sata. Kira la maro soto kere te era koya mate are. Dure are mi are mi are. Kure sera dure. Ninda dure mi are mi are mi are. Allow yourself to slowly come back into this present moment. Wiggling your fingers and your toes, let's send some gratitude to all of our guides for these beautiful activations. We thank you so much. So other ways to balance the sacral chakra are wearing the color orange, sleeping with orange sheets, eating orange fruits and vegetables, organic. So apricots, carrots, mangoes, oranges, peaches, persimmons, 
pumpkins and tangerines. So the crystals are coral, gold, calcite, moonstone, or chameleon. And the essential oils are gardenia, sandalwood, ylang ylang, and damana. Thank you all so much for joining us for this sacral swadhisthana activation and clearing. The divinity within me sees and honors the divinity within you. Namaste. So I wanted to share my book, Symphony Sings With You. It's a story about Symphony the bird who sings love songs and explores Mother Earth. So one day I was meditating at the park and I was getting messages that birds were sharing light codes for us. A few days later, there was a really bad storm. There was this baby bird in my yard. She couldn't fly yet and so I was able to bring her inside and connect to her and it was her first incarnation on Earth. So I was able to give her some healing speak some light codes and sing and give her some food and water and she was able to practice flying around my house the whole evening and the next day the storm had passed and she was able to go outside and was actually able to fly over the building so it was a beautiful moment in my life and I'm so grateful that I was able to capture these photos and place them into um, a cute book that will be inspiring 